Hello and welcome to Bread of Life, a daily devotional program which each week features a different area pastor. Our speaker for this week is Pastor Don Rivers of Colchester. Welcome back to our journey to discover the character of God and how we reflect it. The challenge lies in the fact that we are not God. Therefore, it will be difficult to achieve perfection, but we can put the effort forth to try. God is patient with us as we make progress along the way. Patience. God's Word has a way of building on itself. Just as we cannot reflect the true character of God without the presence of the Holy Spirit, we will find it easier to develop that character if we build on each previous character trait. We are in Galatians 5, 22 through 23. It is said, don't pray for patience. Why? Because God will continually put us in situations where patience is required. That can and is very frustrating if we fail to realize what's going on. We want patience, but we don't want to have to wait to develop it. Waiting isn't something we're good at. We have been conditioned by the world around us to get it now. Don't wait. You'll miss out. It takes patience for good to work its way out. One day, a guy was at a traffic light, patiently waiting for it to turn green. The fellow in front of him seemed to be paying attention, but was deep in thought or looking at his phone The light turned green. He didn't move, beeping, yelling, waving hands, telling him he was number one. Nothing worked. As the light turned yellow, the fellow in front looked up, saw it, and sped through. The guy behind him was livid. He fumed, shook his fist, beat on the dash of the car, and then he noticed the cop behind him, lights flashing. He pulled over. The officer approached. Out of the car, please. He was cuffed and brought into the station. After some time, the officer came back and was apologetic. I'm sorry, sir. I was sure you stole that car. Puzzled, the gentleman asked why. The officer explained he watched the whole scene, all his antics, heard his colorful language, and watched his hand gestures. The officer then noticed the WIHS bumper sticker on the car. That didn't add up. Surely the driver couldn't be a Christian. He certainly didn't display the character traits of God. He must have stolen the car. Romans 2.4 reminds us, Don't you see how wonderfully kind, tolerant, and patient God is with you? Does this mean nothing to you? Can you see that his kindness is intended to turn you from your sin? God shows us his patience with us, helping us and waiting on us to develop the character that reflects his presence in our lives. As I have more life experience, I realize Things don't have to move so fast. Things are not as immediate as I think they are. Oh, don't misunderstand. There are things that need to be done now. But when we develop patience, we will come to the understanding that not everything needs immediate attention. Patience is about letting things sort themselves out, letting things calm down and the dust settle. Patience allows us to see clearly and determine what needs to be a priority. The important and significant things reveal themselves when we have patience to wait and see. One of the tools of the enemy is haste. He prompts us to react and decide before we know the whole story. We are good at jumping to conclusions, wanting to find a solution, and then move on. Truth is that 99 times the things in our head we think need to be dealt with The majority of them are not real. We just think they are. So how do we sort them out? Ask God and patiently wait as he reveals the answer. We never know who is watching. We never know who is following our example. It is important to reflect the character of God if we claim to be his. Think about that this week. You've been listening to Pastor Don Rivers of Colchester. And this has been Bread of Life, a program to encourage you from God's Word.